617 here on your Wednesday morning. Those temps starting off in the 50s. They will climb back into the low to mid 80s. Actually very normal for this time of year. Average highs around 83 here in the Tri-Cities, and that's right about where we're going to be. All right, let's talk about our rain chances here for the end of the week. So as we're looking at kind of the broad picture of things, you know, we've got a pretty good area of low pressure that's moving up into southern Canada. We've got another one here in the southwest. So those are our kind of main areas of low pressure. But our rain chances are actually going to be tied to a couple of things. Cold front coming in Friday, but also these little short waves that get kicked out of these main areas of low pressure. So these are kind of smaller, faster moving areas of low pressure. And I think our rain chances tomorrow evening are starting to come down a bit. I know that's not great news, uh, but it's because that main low pressure system that's been kicked out, the little short wave, is going to move primarily across Kansas, it looks like. And that's where the better rain chances will be tied to. Okay, so I think uh, tomorrow night, don't be shocked if the more widespread rainfall is in Kansas. We will still have chances here in Nebraska tomorrow evening into tomorrow night, but we may actually be looking more Friday, Friday night time frame for a better chance of rain as the cold front moves through. So that's kind of what we're looking at. And we may see that rainfall linger into Saturday morning, so we'll kind of keep an eye on that. Again, Tri-Cities at 56 right now. A little bit of cloud cover overhead. It's just really pleasant. 50 in Ord, 48 in Albion, 58 in Hebron. It is very comfortable this morning. The winds are light. Out west, you're actually a little bit cooler than what you have been lately because you have less in the way of cloud cover. But, you know, here in central and eastern areas, we're 5 to 10 degrees warmer than what we were yesterday at this time. Should be a very quiet Wednesday. Very quiet middle of the week for you. Just a little bit of cloud cover developing this afternoon. And then tomorrow, I think we're going to heat up a few more degrees. And then by the late afternoon hours, we're watching for some storms to try to develop mainly out to the west. And we'll have that chance tomorrow evening, tomorrow night of some scattered activity here in central areas. But like I said, the better chances may be shifting further south, though. 84 the high today in the Tri-Cities. That's about as normal as it gets here for this time of year. 59 tonight and tomorrow we're back close to 90. Can be a little bit on the warm side of things and not much of a breeze even tomorrow. It gets a little stronger, but still very light winds expected. Lincoln could hit around 88 today. So you're going to find the warmer temps off to the east, 82 out in Ogallala and Imperial. Lows tonight, Broken Bow, how about 56? 58 down in Smith Center, 57 McCook. Highs tomorrow, back mid to upper 80s again. But yeah, you get into eastern areas, those 90s are going to start to become more widespread. Then temps head down for a couple of days, starting Friday, but especially Saturday. And then they will head right back up and be close to 90 there on Monday and Tuesday. So we do mix in you know, a cooler day for Saturday, but I think we're going to heat right back up. Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, I think next week could be a little on the warm side, so 